GRDB 18 was released for commercial cultivation in the country on Monday by Agriculture Minister Zulfika Mustafa at Sebastian's Farm, Milton Zul, East Coast, Demerara. The new variety stands out for its plant architecture, strong stems, high yield potential, that is, 7 to 9 tons per hectare, and resistance to blast. It is long, slender grain with good milling and cooking qualities, with research showing only 11 to 13 minutes required for cooking. It has the ability to withstand delayed harvesting for 10 to 15 days, which means less losses for farmers when they do not get to rip the crop on time. Since the genetic composition of this candidate variety is different from all the other varieties, it would also minimize the risk of genetic vulnerability to diseases. Chief Scientist Mahendra Prasad, the expert behind the initiative who conducted the research and development of the new variety, believes that the rice can stand up to the conditions that typically pose challenges to farmers. According to him, the team conducted more than 120 yield and farm trials. If you want something good, you have to develop it for yourself. You have to develop it for your farmers. And we have done that with all the other varieties and now this candidate varieties that we have tested, that came, started work from your local breeding program, starting from hybridization, the entire team have put their hands on this variety. We have tried to mix different genetic background, local and foreign, and come up with something that will be useful to our farmers, taking into consideration not only yield, what the challenges that the, 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 the environment are facing, Minister Mustafa shared that within four years, about two more new varieties would be commissioned. He pointed out how prior to 2020, 36 bags per acre were being produced as compared to the 40 to 42 bags today. The minister said the government is committed to expanding the country's markets to approximately 50 new ones globally. We are not just coming to tell you as rice farmers that in 2030, we want to produce a million tons of uh, metric tons of rice and give you and leave you at that. We will never leave you on your own. We will always work with you to develop this important industry. Students of the Guyana School of Agriculture were on hand to witness the launch, and year two diploma student Jemima Wilson shared her thoughts. Variety that is more resistant and in terms of fighting climate change and all these other issues is, is better than the other varieties. It's something that I know the farmers in Guyana will practice a lot. Guyana is on the verge of targeting food security by 2030. We aim to be the breadbasket for the Caribbean and in other parts. So we know that this variety can help us to better our country and the Caribbean. It is expected that this variety, along with the GRDB 16, will occupy the majority of the farmlands across the country in the next few seasons. For the newsroom, Talisha Ramnarain.